Hello guys, in this video I am going to show you guys how to add beat shake effect like kernel in your video by using Premiere Pro, so let's get started. First of all, after importing the clip and the song, add the bass effect in your song, which helps you to identify that where you have to apply the effect, it's optional if you are using a bass boosted song, now let's set a random value of bass, say 19, now let's hear it and find out it's appropriate or not. It's too much, I think, so reduce the value to 10 and then check out. Still a little bit odd, so let's set the value to 7. After adding bass to your song, let's add markers to your timeline to easily identify the places where you have to add your effect, deselect all the things on your timeline, then start the clip from the beginning, and then press M key on your keyboard to add a marker. This is just a rough trial, so don't worry if you are not too much precise. After adding all the markers to your timeline, Go to editing tab, and enlarge the audio track in which your song is there. Then by looking at the track, make a final trial on your markers and place them precisely. Now go to Effects tab and add a Adjustment layer. Stretch it along your timeline and make a copy of it by holding Alt key and then dragging it. Now right click and rename it as directional blur, it's optional, but for your better understanding I'm doing it. Now similarly rename the other one to scaling. Now, add the respective effect in the adjustment layers, in directional blur, add the directional blur effect and to scaling layer, add transform effect. Now I think the video is going too lengthy, so I will continue it in the next part, till then, stay safe stay healthy love you guys.